Jimmy Caldwell, one minute out. I want to talk to you about drawing our pistol from a seated position. You know, let's say that we're in a restaurant, maybe uh, we're sitting down having food and something breaks out inside the restaurant, a threat presents itself and we have to deal with it. You know, ideally, most of the time when I go into a restaurant, I prefer to not necessarily sit at the back of the restaurant, but wherever I sit at a table, I like to have a view of a majority of the restaurant just so I can see what's going on and have good situational awareness. You know, just take into consideration some of those thoughts when you do go into a restaurant because nowadays we have no idea what's gonna happen in any situation that we're gonna be in, but we need to make sure that we are prepared. So what are the things that we can do to prepare ourselves when we are in that seated position and we may have to draw our pistol? You know, for this situation, I am running my CNG holster. This happens to be my outside the waistband. You know, I've got an overgarment. Maybe I'm out to a nice dinner. I've got my, my sports coat on. I'm looking snazzy, right? Um, so I went with my outside the waistband holster just because it's, you know, maybe easier to draw, easier to conceal because I have that jacket on. All right, so I've got my CNG outside the waistband. Uh, I've got my CNG holsters double mag holder. So I've got more ammunition to deal with whatever may happen. All right, and today I am carrying my Walther. This is my PDP with the Aimpoint Acro red dot on it. Everything still conceals nicely in here, my overgarment on it. And as I'm sitting in this position, if, if a threat or something arises, you know, the main thing is we got to clear that garment. Same thing as if we're standing when this happens. So we're going to go ahead and over exaggerate that clearing of the garment. We may have to move ourselves forward in a seat just to be able to get our hand there to clear it, come back, grab the pistol. Right. Again, the draw is the same as anything. We want to make sure that we come straight up and down as we draw the pistol so that we clear the holster. All right. And if I have to and I'm stuck in that seated position and I have to shoot, we can easily do that. It's not a big deal. Right. We can do the same exact fundamentals. So I bring the pistol in here to center. I'm going to go ahead and complete my grip. I push the pistol out to the threat. Right. My eyes are on the threat as I pick up the threat and then I can prep the trigger, level my sights and engage that threat as I see it. Now, ideally, if I can go ahead and get up out of my seated position, then I would try to do that just so I have better footing or I can then move away maybe from my family to draw that fire away from them or move to a covered position or just, you know, move to and engage with that threat. That's everything I've done in my 21 years in special operations. We're always taught to move towards the threat, all right, because it's a lot easier to shoot a target when it's closer up than it is when it's further away. So the quicker I can get to my feet, get that pistol out and close that distance with the threat and eliminate and um, take fire, you know, shoot on that threat, eliminate it, then I'm going to be more productive. So let's go ahead and take a look at what this may be if I'm just sitting in a restaurant and Something breaks out. Oh, I see a threat. I see a gun. Clear, draw, present. All right, engage with that threat. Once the threat has been eliminated, then I'm going to go ahead like every single time, look, and then holster the pistol. All right, now if I was carrying appendix and I just had my shirt out here, whatever it may be, same exact fundamentals. All right, all I like to do is clear that garment. So over exaggerate, clearing that garment out of the way. I'm going to go ahead and draw that pistol out and then present and get into the best body position that I can. You know, ideally when I'm standing, I like to have that sort of wide feet, you know, sort of that stance to be able to push and move off, you know, and I've got that weight forward to lean into. If I'm in seated position, I can still do the same thing, clear the garment, come out, and you'll see me move forward as I move towards that threat and get my weight forward to help control recoil, be able to move and get up and move towards that threat if I need to, all right? So there's just a couple pointers for you if you had to engage somebody from a seated position, how you're going to draw from the side or from an appendix, clear that garment, get that pistol out and try to take as much of an aggressive stance or an aggressive position as you can to get rounds on target quickly and accurately.